You think you know the story of The Wizard of Oz, but you probably only know part of it. The book that the movie was based on was written by L. Frank Baum and originally published in 1900. Some economists and historians insist that the book is an economic fairy tale, a story about America in the age of the gold standard. In their telling, each character represents a person or group active in the late 1800s. The Scarecrow represents the farmers in the West. Most of these farmers had mortgages and owed money to the bankers in the East. When deflation hit, the value of the farmers' debts rose. The amount they owed the bankers was now worth much more than at the time of the loan. Bad for the farmers, but great for the bankers. The Yellow Brick Road is the gold standard. Many believed the end of the gold standard would fix everything. But the citizens of the East, who are represented by the Munchkins, wanted to keep the gold standard in place. They urged Dorothy to follow the Yellow Brick Road. The farmers weren't the only group suffering and seeking the end of the gold standard. Industrial workers are represented by the Tin Man. His joints are rusted and he can no longer work, much like the 18% of Americans that were unemployed in 1894. The cowardly lion is William Jennings Bryan, a populist leader and the face of the free silver movement. He believed that adding silver to the gold standard would ease deflation and solve the nation's economic woes. And of course, there is a nod to gold in the title, The Wonderful Wizard of Oz, or OZ, the abbreviation for an ounce of gold. The Emerald City is America's capital, Washington, D.C., where everything is seen through dollar-colored glasses, literally, which is why everything appears to be green. In the end, it is Dorothy's shoes that save her, her silver shoes. The shoes were silver in the book, but were changed to ruby for the movie. It turns out the solution was right under her nose the entire time, adding silver to the money supply. Better sheet and one checked bag for the flight there and back.